amazing class how easy it is to use simple, everyday items such as glue and macaroni to make these beautiful Father's Day cards. Yeah, it is amazing. Now, I think we should spend a few minutes talking about our dads and the things they like to do for fun. Okay, who wants to go first? Me! 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 Miss Wells! I'm ready, Miss Wells. Jackie? My father enjoys flying his own plane. Oh. Flying his own plane? Wow! Oh. And who wants to be next? Me! 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 Uh, Rodney? My dad likes to spend his weekends being a volunteer fireman. Wow. Bobby? What? Tell us about your father. Well, uh, um... Sometimes he makes armpit noises that sound exactly like happy birthday. You push me What are you gonna get your father for Father's Day, Bobby? This! My mom heard on the Sally Jaffe show that it's a good idea to give people presents that are related to their hobbies. Oh. It must be hard shopping for a man who makes armpit noises as a recreational activity, Bobby. Yep. I guess he pretty much already has all the stuff he needs. Okay, okay, everybody hop to. It's Father's Day, and I want your father to have a doozy of a good time, don't you know? Howard, breakfast! And it's going to be a breakfast to remember, too. Poached liver and eggs with fresh baked fiber bars and homemade barley butter. Um, this! Bobby, <laughs> what is it? Looks like an exploded pizza. Well, looky here at this now. It's a. Yeah, isn't that nice there then? It's a picture of Dad. Right, oh, and a beautiful one too. Her mom's great. Well, there's nothing better than the smell of poached liver in the morning, don't you know? It's just the best is all. And that's exactly what my Howard deserves for Kay and Italy's sake. The best! <laughs> now, don't forget, I want you kids to come to the mall with me this afternoon, Ski, so we can pick out a real special Father's Day present for that father of yours. What are we gonna get him? I know what we can get him, I know, I know! And all day pass to the monkey cages at the zoo. <laughs> Bobby, that is like so totally daft. Okay, and how about a limited edition Captain Squash laser powered lunchbox? That's an even stupider idea than the monkey cages. Come on, Webley. We're going somewhere where the people are nicer. Man, were those lame suggestions that we had for Dad's present or what? Oh! Look who's talking there now. I haven't heard you come up with an idea for the perfect gift, Einstein. The perfect gift for Dad. Hey, you know what Dad would really like for Father's Day? Some fishing stuff. You know how crazy he is about fishing? Ah, take him fishing. That's the perfect present. Happy Father's Day, Dad. Thanks, Bobby. I'm having a great time, and this fishing trip is the perfect present. I knew it would be. We're gonna need a bigger boat! Don't worry, Dad. This is my fantasy. I can fix it. something Dad really likes. What you are hearing, ladies and gentlemen, is the sound of every father in the world yelling his favorite overused parental threat at the top of his lungs. We've heard everything from, where did your mother and I go wrong, to someday you'll thank me for this. 
And now, shouting out that old chestnut, is the winner of this year's Father's Day International Yelling Contest, Howard Generic. Don't make me have to come in there! That's Generic! Congratulations, Mr. Generic. What a perfect way to celebrate Father's Day. Right? Like, get a grab! Totally turn that TV off and get in here for breakfast right now, Bobby. It's that special day, Wendy. I still don't know what his present should be. Oh, poached liver. Huh? Uh, well, look, look. Hey, you, you really don't have to do anything else for me for Father's Day, Martha. I'm, I'm, I'm serious, really. Oh, don't be silly there now, Howard. The kids and I are gonna purchase you a real whisping of a present at the mall this afternoon. Oh, honestly, all, all I want is a, is a quiet day. I just want to kick back, put my feet up, and watch the big game. That's it. I know exactly what to give Dad for Father's Day. This is so exciting, Webley. It's that special day, and I'm going to give him exactly what he wants. Bobby, mm -hmm. uh, hon, are you sure you don't want to come with us to shop for your dad? Thanks, Mom! I'll just stay here and keep that company! Boy, Webley, this is gonna be great! Oh, that's a busted axle. Hey, Babo! Hi, Uncle Ted. See you inside. It's that special day. I gotta give him his present. So I'm giving you Exactly what you said you wanted, Dad. The whole day off with nothing to do. Gee, thanks, Sport. That sounds great. It's gonna be great, because I'm gonna take care of you while you sit back and relax. All you have to do is enjoy the peace and quiet. <laughs> oh, ho, ho. that's a pain, huh? Here, here, uh, let me give you a hand, Howard. Oh, up there. There. oh. Oops! <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, my TV's on the fritz, so I, I came over to watch the big game. Brought a few snacks. Uh, probably got you with the herring dip and a couple of cans of peanut butter corn dogs there. Sorry. It's okay, Ted. I'm... I'm fine. These aren't snacks, Uncle Ted. They're just empty cans. Oh, that's a goof. I must have grabbed the wrong bags. These are the empty socks in the can cans that I've been meaning to take to the recycling center. Oh, no, no, don't worry about it, Ted. I'm, I'm sure Martha has uh, plenty of snacks in the kitchen. Let me just let Roger out and I'll... No, Dad, you go sit down. I'll get the snacks and let Roger out because this is your special day. I've seen Mom make dip lots of times. Oh, I made her some ingredients. I can make my own dip. Chef Wolfgang, Chef Wolfgang Bobby, the most famous chef in the whole wide world. How did you get your star? Well. It actually started with snacks for my papa on his special day. What's that? Oh, maybe I should remind Bobby to make sure that the back gate is closed so Roger doesn't get into Mr. Smittle's yard again. Relax, Howard. You told him a million times. How could he forget? Roger's in Mr. Smittle's yard, chasing Mr. Smittle's cat. Mr. Smittle says, come quick and bring a ladder. I'm the name of your attorney. Oh, the big game just started, and it looks like it's going to be the most exciting one in history. Oh, 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 oh. 
Mr. Smittle. Times have I told you to make sure the gate is closed before you let Roger? Power kick, come quick! Hurry up! Things are going nuts in the big game! I love Uncle Tom. Yeah. Whoops! Just a slight sprain. Mr. Generic is fine. That's generic. All he needs is a little rest. Don't you worry. I'll take good care of him, because he's my dad, and it's his special day. What a lovely little boy. Oh, <laughs> I'm the boy's uncle. <laughs> Loveliness runs in the family. Allow me to introduce myself, Ted Newtonbergen Sven. Oh, that's a rip. <gasps> After these messages. Okay, Dad. As soon as I finish making the dip, I'll bring you a snack and then. No, that's okay. That's okay, Bobby. All, all, all I want to do now is just sit here and watch the big game. What's, what's left of it? Tell you what, Bobbo. Uh, why don't you go upstairs and take a bath? And as soon as I finish putting a seam back in my pants here, I'll take over for you in the kitchen. Superpowered submarine. Dive, dive, dive! And we left the starboard bow. The 
enemy is in our sights. Fire tickler torpedo. Activate tickler. Day, and I'm still taking care of you. Okay. Oh, there's that stupid cat, you know? You know, Ted, I... Hey, I love animals, but that thing drives me right up a wall. Drives Dad up a wall? Time, pal. What do you have to say about that? Hey, who wants snacks? You know, right before the power went out, uh, I just finished making a big batch of chili cheese anchovies. <laughs> what say there, Howard? In the mood for some suds and snacks? Don't forget that. You can have anything you want, because it's your special day. Thanks, Bobby. But the only thing I really want to do right now is see whatever I can of the big game. Don't worry, Dad. The big game's coming. I just gotta find the right channel. Yes! Did you see that, ladies and gentlemen? What a finish! We'll be talking about this one for years to come! Bobby, move! I can't see the screen! Come on, Roger. Dad wants to watch the big game. Oh, my! What a game! Was. I'll tell you, this will be talked about for years to come, ladies and gentlemen. So until next year, this is Stevie Spielmeyer for Spectacular Sports. So long. Huh? Yoo-hoo! Where is that big, burly, handsome husband of mine? Ofer! Well, what in the Sam Hills of Splints and Traction happened here, Howard? Uh, well, I uh, see, Martha, Bobby was just trying to give Howard the day off, and, uh, well... This is your fault, dweeb? <laughs> Bobby, like, totally ruin Father's Day, why don't you? It was a dumb idea to give Dad a special day as a present. I should have gone to a mall with everybody else, lovely. The only good kind of present is a kind you buy at the store. Hey, 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 that's, that's not true. I liked your present, Bobby, just as, just as much as the one from the mall. You did? Yeah, because it came from your heart. See, what makes a present good doesn't have anything to do with how much money you spend on it, Bobby. It's the thought that counts. Remember that. If it's the thought that counts, then for my birthday, I think I'm gonna ask Dad to count on giving me exactly what I want. A new Captain Squash laser-powered lunchbox! 